I think when we come over the top of this mountain, we'll be able to see our monster in person for the first time since we left Kakariko. So let's see. Okay. Oh, oh no. What's up guys, this is Luke with West Second Gaming. We are back with another episode of Zelda Breath of the Wild Monster Hunting, where we take to the high mountains and seas and valleys of Hyrule and we hunt the biggest, baddest monsters and try to collect as many rupees as we possibly can. Uh, so today we are going to start here at Kakariko Village, if I'm saying that correctly. And what we're going to do today is we want to get over to this monster right here. Now I have this monster marked. I'm not sure what it is. It could be a Lionel, could just be a Hinox. I'm not really sure. Um, so we have to find a path that makes sense to get over there. So what I think we're going to do is we're going to go past the Great Fairy, work our way through this West Gate, around through here, cross the bay, to the skull. I think that's the way we're gonna go, but you never know in this game, you have one set plan and as you go, it's very easy to get off off track. So right now we're just gonna head down into Kakariko and we're gonna get some supplies, make sure we have weapons and everything we need. There's the chicken. <laughs> See what happens if we hit the chicken. <laughs> got some bird eggs, great. Oh, and all the arrows are gone. Okay, so I think right now we are still we're fairly stocked up with arrows. We have 40 bomb arrows. Not much more you need than that. Follow this road, it'll wrap around um, and sort of take us in the direction where we want to go. Kind of here, really a great view from up here at the edge of the village. See the castle, some shrines along the way, and this big boggy muck down here, Death Mountain up there. Uh, so we want to head over this way again towards this skull as our final. Uh, point that we're trying to get to and right now we have just over 49,000 rupees so at the end of this we're going to cash in all our monster parts and see what uh we get as far as the total on the monster parts so I think instead of going down through there we're going to use our last Revali try to get up high I already got the champion's ballad uh, upgrade with the Revali's Gale so that refreshes very quickly, so I'm not too worried about using that. Let's get on top of this mountain and see what's up on top of here. Because again, this is it's a monster hunt, but it's also you know, a good chance for us to collect some good stuff along the way that we can use to fight monsters in the future. So if there's collectibles or anything to be had along the way, uh, we do want to stop and grab those as well. Okay, so we climbed all the way up here for a couple of blue nightshades. There's the great fairy fountain down there. I don't think there's really much she can do for us at this point. So we're just gonna focus on the task at hand and we wanna go that direction over there. So let's just sort of launch off. So here we go, let's stick to the high mountains. I don't wanna go down in that muck down there. No monsters yet, so it's been relatively quiet but I feel like it might be the calm before the storm. So a really cool, uh, Sunset going down right now. Very beautiful. Very beautiful game. I really do love this game. Uh, just the aesthetics of everything. Okay, so no monsters creeping right now. Not as important here. Oh, no. Okay. That's the end of that. Quick and easy. Some electric key swings. Uh, not the most lucrative monster part, but it'll be a few extra rupees. So fox running up there. I usually let the foxes... Live. Okay, so we can take these guys out pretty easy. These guys are super easy. I do drop some parts. Whack, whack. Oh, whiff. I just whiff. All right, there we go. All right. So yeah, so the nighttime monsters are really not very hard. They drop a few decent parts here and there, but for the most part, uh, they're not very useful. They just make fighting bigger, stronger monsters more complicated sometimes. Anything. So I see something on top of there. I don't know if I've got that yet. Should be good now. And I think this is a Korok. Oh, no. Hmm. Frog. I don't know if I've ever seen this. Do I put an apple in there, maybe? Hmm. Oh, it did. Beautiful. Okay. So we got an extra Korok. We have quite a few Korok seeds now, which we can actually probably go catching. We have 26. Um, so that'll probably get us at least one or two extra. We'll take our apple back. 
Thank you. <laughs> Let's actually put a landmark over here. Purple. Still don't see it, but now at least we have something we can work our way towards. Let's keep going. We're bound to run into some monsters at some point here. There's a fire there. Let's go check out what's going on down there. Maybe a Yiga clan member or something like that. See if we can actually get on his back. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Soothe, 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 soothe. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> he killed my... You... You son of a gun. I don't even remember dropping a bomb. You killed my deer, and I'm going to kick your head. And then I'm going to kill you. So I do have a Korok mark down there. It's... Can I hit that from up here? I have no bow on. All right, so I'm gonna break out the ancient bow for this. Because I wanna see if I can snipe this thing from deep. Hold on it. The ancient bow. Oh man, so we just gotta shoot a little bit high. The ancient bow usually shoots really straight, but I think we're just a little far away. Just gotta shoot a little bit high. Nailed it. Yes, another Korok seed. So, so far we have really not gotten much uh, as far as monster parts, but we have picked up two Korok seeds already. Oh, so there's a dragon. Okay, so we can get some drag. We may be able to get a dragon part here. So that's really huge. Oh, I don't know if we can get up there that quick. Let's put on a high level speed boost, see if we can catch up. If we can't, maybe just catch the tail end of this thing. We still have our ancient bow on. I think we're way, 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 way too far away. But let's give it one. One shot. Can we hit it one shot hype? Way over the back. Okay, so we went over top that time. Can we hit it? Can we hit it? Oh. I think he's too far away now. Okay, so that's unfortunate, but... Oh, <laughs> stupid keys. Oh, man, everything's coming after us now. Okay. Take care of his body parts just flying everywhere. Ooh, okay, so we're gonna be able to get the headshot. We're gonna be able to get a headshot. All we care about right now is that dragon. Okay, oh, he's going the other way. He's going the other way, but maybe we can hit him here. Okay, so that's a nice shot right there. We should, that should hit him. That should absolutely hit him. That should absolutely hit him. From deep. Come on. Oh. I don't know if something fell in there or not. I don't know if something just fell or not. Oh, and if we go down there now, we're never going to get out because it's pouring. And it's raining next time too, so. Okay, so I think the dragon evaded us this time. We're going to have to watch out for him and come back and get him again next time. Okay, so we can pick up some gems here that we can sell. But it's not a bad haul there. Some opal. Just keep going, Link. Just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna just follow the river along the left side and then we'll try to cross when we get to the end uh, once the rain has passed. All right, so here's a tunnel. Definitely get some gems. Ooh, luminous stone. Oh, okay. Booby traps. Another. Ooh, ooh. Coming down on the... Beach of the river here. Looks pretty cool. Icy mountain. Okay, so if we cut through this back part here, we would swing around and come down to find our monster. So let's see if there's anything hiding in these. There's a wind. I thought I just heard a monster snort. So there's an uprising wind here. So there's some Lozolfos there. Get them. Let's see where this takes us first. Okay, ride it out, ride it out. It's gonna start getting cold, I think. Okay, so we found this here. Oops. That's a miss. <laughs> it's a big miss. That's not. Okay, so. Okay. Where were those Lizolfos? Okay, so there's a Lizolfo camp down there, so let's raid that bad boy. Fire arrows, and we'll go with the spread shot. 
All right, here we go. So what's that? Oh, so that's a, another Korok down there. We can go get that after we take out these those office because it's good to come in from high up. And if we can get on top of their camp, we we'll probably snipe one out from up here. Okay. And here we go, baby. Oh, okay, so he's done. It's one and done. Oh, no. That guy's still alive. That guy's still alive. But not for long. Come on. Oh, he's getting away. He's getting away. I'm not shooting too low here. Okay, so I just blew him up again. He's dead. Okay, perfect. So, I'm going to save the bomb arrows. We'll do some shock arrows here. Okay, get a get right in his face. Oh, that's a beautiful headshot right there. <laughs> oh, he's taking it. He took one. Okay, but he can't take two. So, that's down for him. Let's see what they dropped for us. Some horns, some tails. There might... I think there's another one around here, and I think there's some inside. So, let's be careful here. Oh, okay. Okay. Boom. Okay, so let's get him. All right, here we go. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I snuck attack. I sneak attacked him. I sneak attacked him. Perfect. That was perfect. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there he is. Same guy. Okay, so I accidentally... I don't know how I accidentally sneak attacked that guy. So I kicked my bomb away. Okay, got him. All right, perfect. Okay, so we got ourselves a chest. That's a nice little treasure for Monster Hunt. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got here. Okay, so we got 100 rupees, so just cash money. That's what it's all about, baby. Cash money. It's all we're here for is to try to blow these monsters up and get some cash money. So, just make sure they remember. Our name by blowing up their whole cabin. Okay, let's see. Where is he? Come here, you little bugger. Come here. Come here. Hit him off. There we go. Got him. All right, so that's three Koroks in this uh, little hunt. Okay, so as you can see, we are actually just across this body of water uh, from our monster. So let's see if we can get over there. We already took out these Lizalfos that were kind of blocking the way. Oh, there is a drop there. So we got a nice bunch of shock arrows. So nice. We found ten shock arrows. That's definitely helpful. Can use this wind to get straight across here. Looks like a broken down little monster village here. What do we call it? We do have a chest here. Um, oh no, okay. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Fight, I can fight. Got him. Okay, nice. So, okay, so he left us some rupees and some uh, tentacles and things. So good, we're so we. Got uh, a little bit of rupees on our own so far here uh, without before we cash stuff in. Okay, so what is up there? Let's see if we can grab this crab. Okay, so that's right where we're going, right up there. Okay, so we're at our mark, so we can get rid of that. So our monster is right up on this plateau, and it looks like there's some sort of ruins up there. I really don't remember what this is. It's starting to rain again, of course. I really want to get the drop on this guy, see what he is before we just come face to face with him. I think when we come over the top of this mountain, we'll be able to see our monster in person for the first time since we left Kakariko. So let's see. Okay. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I thought it might be something easy. I was hoping for the sake of the video that it was something hard, but for the sake of my own sanity, I was kind of hoping it was something not so hard, but it is indeed a gold Lionel. So let's do this. It's raining right now. So I think we're gonna sit here, we're gonna wait it out, and then as soon as it gets past the rain, we're just gonna bum rush this guy and we're gonna take him out. Um, we're gonna try to do this one life, first life. We don't wanna die to this guy. We have Mifa, we have um, three herboses. We have Daru. We have everything we need to be able to take this guy out with one shot here. So let's let this rain pass and we'll get him. Let's see. What we want to do is I think I'm going to Revali up over top of him and then just rain down arrows on him. 
We have a lot of shields. We want to put the Barbarian Helm on for this. Back up again. We want to use everything the game gives us. Now, we collected all this stuff on our previous monster hunt, so now we're reeking, we're reaping the benefits of that uh, because we cooked all the stuff we found into meals, and now we have all these hearts. And to start the strategies, we want to hit him with a attack mode. So as soon as this rain subsides completely, we're going to take our attack mode, potion, and attack him. So let's see. He's right there. We can see him. Okay. Heart's going a little bit. Heart's pumping. Heart's pumping. So we're going to have to watch those towers because if he's coming after us or he's trying to shoot flames, if we're not paying attention and we back into those towers, we can get stuck between him and one of the pillars or towers, whatever they are. Um, and that could really kill us. So we really have to be careful. Uh, about that so the rain is slowing down it looks like i don't think you can see us now i can't see us now okay so the rain has subsided so i'm going to throw on this high level attack boost i'm also going to put on the lionel sword we're going for it we're going for it here this is going to be one try hype here okay, so we want to get above him see if we can't maybe land on his back and just hack away at him with this lionel sword don't turn around, don't turn around, don't turn around. Okay. We got him, we got him, we got him. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. I say, so quick, I want to quick switch to a different arrow. Because if I shoot a bomb arrow up for, at him from right behind him, I'm going to explode myself. So I want to hit him real hard here, slow down time, and then deliver a few headshots. So before he even knows what happens, I got him maybe 20% down in health before he even knows that we're here. Oh, see, we're right there. That's the pillar I was talking about. You don't want to back into those pillars. That's dangerous business. We don't want them to start regenerating. Okay. Okay, this is where we want them. In close, so we can just flurry rush the bejesus out. He's going to try again. Yes. Okay, I think we got this guy so far. And our attack is up. We're at full health, but... These golden lionels, I mean, one hit, one hit just almost wiped me out. So we're going to go back to our food tank. Okay. Get in the face. Oh, boy. Okay, so we're going to get away from this. We'll jump back in it. Get him in the face. Get him in the face. You want to get him in the face and stun him. Okay, so he's stunned. We can get over there. We can get over there. Okay, we're probably going to break this sword. Okay, so pretty good so far. So far, so good. Okay, here you got to get away. This is where you don't want to hit one of the towers or the pillars. Okay, so... Okay. Ooh, headshot. Ooh, another shot. Oh, that dropped him. That dropped him. That dropped him. Okay, so we want to quick change weapons because that one's about to break, and I don't want to be on his back and my weapon breaks. So we're going to break out another heavy hitter here. Go to town on him. Bomb arrows. We want to be patient. Oh, oh. Okay. So we still have our Bosa. We still have all that stuff we could hit him with, but I'm going to save that. If we don't think we might need it. Oh, perfect shot. Perfect shot. Okay, he didn't get a chance to do his huge... Uh, stomp like an angry lionel. So, oh, he's coming after us now. Though, okay, okay, he hasn't been coming in close. So let's see. The gold lionels sometimes tend to stay far away. Okay, I don't even have a shield on right now. Oh my. <laughs> let's see. Yeah, there we go. Now we got him. Now we got him. We can really tap his jaw now. Look at that face. I want that sword. I really want that sword. I think we're good here. I think we're good. Even if he gets us backed up, we can throw a or boast at him or something. But I'm going to try to finish this out without her. Save that for another hunt. Okay, so he's just taking some punishment now. He literally got us once. Oh, perfect. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Alright, so let's change the arrows again. Set him on fire this time. Oh, perfect. Okay. Just keep peppering him to the head. Okay, here we go. Oh, no, no, no. no. You don't want that because that's not good. That's not good. Okay. I dropped my bow because he hit me with that stupid electric arrow. 
So let's return the favor, but we want to make sure we go back and get that bow after this fight, because that was a 38 bow, so. Oh, I'm up against... The... See, that's what I was talking about. I'm up against the thing. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, so he's going to kill us here immediately if we don't do something. So we want to fully max health, and we want to do a high-level defense boost. Defense boost. That might save us from what's about to happen here. Oh, we survived. Okay, he didn't get us. He didn't get us. Okay, so... So our defense is up, so we can really go at him now. We gotta just be able to take him down now. Just feeding him bomb arrows. Just feeding him bomb arrows. Okay, so he's down. He's down. We might have him sooner. We might have him. Oh, I see my other ball laying there on the ground. We almost got him. We almost got him. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. I think we got him, though. We still got this. We still got this. Okay, just dodge the fire. Just keep running to the side. Dodge the fire. Let's get in on him close. Oh, so he can't resist then. Yes. Let's bait him into a close combat fight. Finish him out. Come on, come on. Come on, come get me. Yes, there we go. Bait him into that close combat. We can finish him off. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's going to take one more. Shoot him in the butt. <laughs> oh, that's it. That's it. That champion wins again. And the mighty Lionel falls in high grass. Oh, yes. And look at that drop. So much good stuff. So we got... The Lionel Bow, that shoots a 46 times 3. Wow, I've never seen one that high. I've never seen the times 3 as high as 46. So that's really huge. Attack up by 14. That's a nice bow. Lionel Guts, Lionel Horn, Sapphire, Horn, Shock Arrows, Who, Shock Arrows, Rubies, Shock Arrows. Let's see what this Lionel Shield looks like. Okay, nice. So good, good there. And then the Lionel Sword. So let's see what we got. 58 with the durability up so that's nice so we got some weapons in return uh, for what we lost so yeah whew. okay so we were able to take out that lionel so let's just see what's else what else is around uh this little little ruins here oh boy so i hear blood moon coming but i also see this dragon coming so we beat the lionel we got to our destination but let's see if we can actually get uh this a horn uh, from this monster quick while we're here because we can fetch good rupees uh, from a monster horn so we're pretty high along here let's get over to this one okay so we want to get him but we don't really want it to fall into the water either so i'm going to go for a headshot here i'm going to get a horn or something along those lines Okay, so let's use our volley. Oh, we're gonna be right. Let's get right in his face. Let's get right in his face. Okay. okay so we're right there. Let's see if we can get him right in the eye. Right in the eye. Boom. Where'd it go? Okay, perfect. Look at that majestic beast. Alright, so let's go down and see what we got. I don't know. I never shot one in the eye before. Uh, so let's see what you get uh, for that. A shard of Nadra's horn. Alright, so cool. We should be able to get some really good uh, rupees for that. So we got some Lionel parts. We got some dragon parts. Pretty successful monster hunt. Not the most bountiful. We didn't come across the most uh, lower tier monsters on the way there. We didn't even see one Boca Boblin. Uh, but we did kill a gold lionel. We got a really cool part of a dragon. And we had a good time along the way. So let's go back to uh, Kakariko Village and let's sell our parts. And let's see what we get as far as uh, rupees. Okay, so we're back here at Kakariko Village. You can see our buddy Kelton up there on the mountain. But we're not really worried about him right now. We want to go down uh, to the shop and sell some of these parts and see what we can get for them. Here we are just over 49 when we started so let's sell these gems and our monster parts and see what we can get Mom? 
We have one Lionel Gut and one Lionel Hoof, but I like to save those and use those to make potions, and then we can sell them for even more later on. So we're going to hold on to those. We did get these electric key swings back in the beginning, so we'll sell all those, get those out of here. So we do have the Shard of Nadra's Horn here. We're going to get 300 rupees for that. Although after selling the Shard of Nadra, uh, we did get a little over 51,000 rupees here at, at this point now. So we got a little over 2,000. Okay, so we are done with our monster hunt. Wasn't the most uh, abundant of monsters, but we did get to kill a gold lion at the end of the road. And we did get to see that cool dragon and we got to shoot him right in the eye, which I've never done before. So that was a lot of fun. Um, Link is back here. He's winding down. He's taken off his armor. He's got the Nintendo t-shirt on. He's hanging by the fire in Kakariko. He's going to take a rest. And that's going to wrap up another episode of Breath of the Wild Monster Hunting. If you have any ideas for certain monsters you would like me to take on or certain parts of the map that you'd like to see explored, um, feel free to leave it in the comments. If you have any suggestions, I'd love to hear what you have to say. Um, so Link is going to take a rest till morning. He will be back another time in another episode of Breath of the Wild Monster Hunting. So thank you for watching. And until then, take it easy.